Hey guys, uh, just wanted to give you a little update on a project I have going here. Just made some really good progress, so just wanted to show you guys. Um, so without further ado, this is what it is. Uh, the latest thing that I did, this is uh, X Xbox original uh, laptop project. And the last thing that I did was hooked up the video. So I have a, a laptop screen here connected to the original Xbox motherboard. Um, so how that works here I'll show you is uh, here's a adapter board so the LCD screen connects to the adapter board and then it goes to VGA and to the original Xbox motherboard and it connects to this little card. This card is a component to VGA adapter. It um, was a cable made for numerous game consoles um, and I just took it apart and then wired it up the Xbox motherboard. I know I could have flashed a VGA BIOS or a BIOS that supports VGA resolution to um, to the the TSA or mod chip, but I decided to go this route. So um, this chip here supports a variety of resolutions. So uh, I don't know. I saw another person do it, and it looked like a good way to go. Um, so now I can run all different kinds of BIOSes and still have that that VGA output so uh, up above is a audio amplifier board this is a class D audio amplifier board um, I originally wanted to use a class B um, but I ran into problems I might try to do it again this is a little board that I made but kept having problems so just bought some speakers wired up the speakers and um, it's all right. It sounds okay, but I don't know. I'm gonna try the class B again. But um, the power supply is down here. It's a mini ATX power supply. Uh, sports 150 watts. So uh, have that connected here. Here's the brick of a power supply connected to it. But. Um, Everything is running off its own power supply at this point. Uh, like the audio amplifier board has power connected to it. Um, the VGA adapter does. Uh, this is just because I'm just in the testing stages still. Um, I know that this mini ATX will power the motherboard, um, but I'm not sure if it'll power the motherboard and everything else yet. And I'm going to test how much wattage it uses. I'm also going to see a temperature gauge on the power supply to see that it's not getting too hot. Um, I've checked the specs and stuff and where it should be, so uh, I'm going to just do some further testing before I hook everything up to this this uh, little power supply. So, but uh, so yeah, I'll uh, turn it on for you guys. Well, there you go. So I don't have the hard drive hooked up or the laptop optical drive, so well, it's not super clear right now. Can't really get a great picture on it, but but yeah, so I know it works. Uh, there's still a lot of progress to go here, um, but uh, I'll keep you guys updated and hopefully you found this little video interesting. Okay, thanks. Bye.